Hi, and welcome to another episode of the Haltech Q&A. Today, we'll be answering questions on specific engine applications, including the G35, LS2, and RB30. Our first question today comes from Mr. Goodman. I'm putting an LS2, the one with an electronic throttle in my car. What ECU would you recommend? Well, Mr. Goodman, the good news for you is that the Elite 2500 series ECU is the one that you're after. It offers full sequential injection, direct fire ignition, it controls your factory electronic throttle, as well as offering banked knock control and banked O2 control for your fueling. Now, it gets a little bit better than that because we actually do a direct terminated harness to suit the LS2. Now, this harness incorporates a fuse box assembly, all the factory connectors, and everything's labeled. So you can go through, plug everything in, you need to put power, ground, and an ignition source to it, hit the key, and you're ready to get to the tuners. Our next question today comes from Tristan Beck. I have an RB30 turbo with a few mods. Is there an advantage of going to Elite over the PS1000 or PS2000? Well, Tristan, it's a good question. The Sport 2000 or the, the PS2000 will control your RB30 with sequential injection, direct fire ignition. It will do all your boost control and all your idle control. Now, the advantages of going to the Elite ECU would more not be all of the long-term learning features. So the Elite Series ECU does all the long-term learning on all of your cold starting, all of your idle control. It's got long-term learning on all the knock control, as well as the fueling. So the ECU will actually record the air-fuel ratios that you're running, as well as your targets, and then over time make adjustments so that you get the best performance and the best economy out of your engine. So yes, there is an advantage about going to the Elite Series ECU, but the Sport will still do a great job of running your engine. Our last question today comes from Charlie Odom. He writes, Hello, I have a G35 with a built twin turbo 4 litre and a fuel system that's got 12 injectors. Do any of the Haltechs support 12 injector setups? Charlie, the answer is yes. The Elite 2500 series will offer what's called staged injectors. So that controls a primary set of injectors and a secondary set of injectors. Now, in the tune, we set that up so that the secondary injectors turn on above, say, about 80% of the primary injector. That way, when you're cruising around, starting, idling, the car's running on the primary injectors, as soon as you start demanding higher horsepower, both the primary and the secondary injectors come on to be able to fuel your car to make the most power it can. Well, that's about it for today. If you've got any questions that you'd like answered, leave them in comments below, or feel free to send us an email. As always, my name's Scott, and thanks for watching.